Morning Show, War of the Roses. Stephanie, you said you found something that you think belongs to your boyfriend, David. I, I think this is something that would freak a lot of women out. Yeah, I would think so. So, I mean, he was at my apartment, and he decided to go for a run, and he had left his, like, dirty gym bag on my couch, and so I, like, was moving it because it's gross, whatever, but it kind of spilled over, and two pregnancy tests fall out of it. And so I'm like, what the hell is this? And so when he gets home, I, like, confront him with it, and he ends up telling me some bullshit about it's his sister's. Like, he went and picked him up for his sister, which I guess is possible except that like i know his sister really well and she just went through a bad breakup he definitely he's not pregnant you know what i mean like that was a terrible excuse and then i just i don't know i didn't really know what to say after that and i was like well maybe i'll call you guys and put him on war of the roses so, okay okay <sighs> man yeah what if they're for somebody else oh uh i would that's the most plausible explanation now, if he still sends the flowers to you, are you, are you going to confront him about the pregnancy tests? Yeah, I think no matter what, I have to ask him about that. Yeah, I, think, right? I, I think so, too. Okay. All right. I'm going to call him up. Remain quiet. Remember, remain quiet even while we try to figure out what he puts on the note, okay? Okay, definitely. Here we go. Hello? Hey, I'm looking for David, please. Uh, yeah, this is him who's calling. Hi, David. My name's Ashley. I'm calling from Flowers for You, and you are the winner of our Instagram tag contest. Congratulations. I have your handle here. Um, one of your friends tagged you on our post, and we randomly selected you to get $100 in beautiful free red roses to send to the one you love. Uh, my, what? My friend tagged me in a... I, just, I won flowers? Yeah. Uh, it's a contest that we do on Instagram. I'm sure you've seen these giveaways before. Um, it's just a tag contest. Then we randomly select someone. Oh. Do you have someone oh, you'd like okay. to send romantic roses to? Um, yeah, I guess. I could. If they're free. Yep, 100% free. I don't need a credit card from you, and I can have them out as early as this afternoon. Okay, sure. All right, so I just need the name of the person that you'd like to send these flowers to. Uh, put Abby. Okay, we're sending them to Abby, and I have a card to go with Abby's roses. Uh, can I put anything? Sure. Okay, put, I know this doesn't fix everything, but I want you to know I'll be there no matter what. Okay. <laughs> David, did you get somebody pregnant? What? You got somebody pregnant. What's going pregnant? on? What is this? It's Manny Roy and Loren on Kiss 95.1. This is War of the Roses. You're live on the radio. So, David, you were talking to Loren, our co-host, and Stephanie heard everything. It's not It's not what it looks like. It's not like a... It, I mean, this was a joke. David, you, have, to you need to start explaining because she also found the pregnancy tests. Yeah, I know, I know she found the pregnancy tests. She asked me about those. I told her they were for my sister. Is your sister's name yeah, Abby? No. But that's a that's a joke. I mean, nobody actually wins those competitions or those big giveaways anyway. Like that's not. I was just messing with a telemarketer. Wait, you you're playing a joke on us? Is that your excuse? About, but David, I, I'm just going to ask you right now. Like, did you get somebody pregnant? Can you just tell me the truth? <sighs> Maybe I don't know. I I mean, obviously. Maybe I haven't used you them, don't know. Like what? It might not be mine. Is the thing okay? Who's Abby? <laughs> who the hell? Who cares who Abby is? He's like, it might not be mine. Well, it might be yours too, which means that you move furniture with somebody else other than Stephanie. I'm, I'm, I'm guessing that's Abby. Yes. Okay, <laughs> I met like three months ago. Uh, I was three drunk. months ago. 
I, I'm, I'm, I was, I was drunk. I don't know. I didn't know what was going on. And, and then it, it was just one time. And that's, that's it. It was just the one time we were both drunk. And then I get this message from her like a week ago. But I don't, I don't know. I don't know if it's my kid or not. That's, I want to, first of all, I need to know if she is, if she is pregnant at all. And second of all, I, I need to get a DNA test to figure out if I am the dad. Because if I'm not, then it doesn't matter. Well, it kind of does. Are you talking about it doesn't matter. Like, it shouldn't matter to me if you're not, if you didn't impregnate this random girl three months ago. Yeah, he slept like, with her, but he didn't get her pregnant. So why can't you just continue moving on with your relationship, Stephanie? Is that so much to ask? I mean, David. Yeah, yeah, actually, it really is. You're delusional, David. All right. Good luck, dude. Uh, there, you got your answer, Stephanie. Great. Yeah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Want more War of the Roses? Listen to them on demand anytime using the Kiss 95.1 app or Amazon Alexa.